Okay, today um, I'm going to be making a video on how to make a paracord bracelet uh, with the cobra weave. Uh, today we're just going to be doing one color, and that's just going to be black. Uh, you can do it in two colors, but I'm probably going to make a separate video on that. Uh, and this is just with one color. So I measured out eight feet of black paracord, and then I just have, oops, I have my clip. Uh, and what I like to do is I like to take uh, the side with one slit and hold it upright so you have the slanted part down. Take your paracord and feed it through the bottom of that clip. Take the same end and then put it back through the top. So you get this loop, and then you want to equal the ends out, so I'm just going to quick do that. So the two ends are at the same length, then you have this big loop. Um, actually, we're just going to make that shorter, so we're going to take two ends and just pull them through, uh, getting the smaller loop, and then take the two loose ends and grab it through the loop and pull it through, so you have that, and then you pull, and that will just cinch down. And that is one side of the bracelet. Then go to the other side. So you have those two ends. And you have the other side, so it's facing up right, and you're going to go through the top. So you take one end and put it through the top. If I can get that. And then you're going to do the same with the other loose end, and just put it through the top. And then you pull down. So you have that. And then you measure around your wrist. You just take the bracelet off. Put it Flip it around your wrist. Sorry, you can't see that. Clip it around. And then you want to give yourself a, a good amount. Uh, people sometimes go like that, put it on the wrist, and then do that in between the buckle. I do that sometimes if I'm just doing a single. Um, but I'm just going to quick measure it up against one of my other bracelets. Sorry about that. Alright. And then, so you have that, and you have these two loose ends here. Take the one on the right. Cross it over the top, so you have that. Take the one on the left, go over the one you just crossed over, so like that. Bring it under and through the loop right there. And then you're just going to cinch that down. So you have that. Next part is to take the tag end on the left, cross over, take the tag end on the right, go over that piece you just crossed over, go under and through the loop, 
and pull tight. Once again, take the one on the right, cross over, take the one on the left, cross on top, under, back, and through. And then, if you can see that, you can start to see the cobra weave pattern. Now, some people, what they do is they make an S, like that, and that's kind of pointless because this is what happens. You, They go put the tag in through the bottom part of the S, then once they do that, the, it doesn't matter because you're doing the same thing by crossing over. So. I just find it takes more time. So, just gonna quick finish this up. Um, uh, when I started to make the bracelets, uh, I had some trouble first starting out with the knot. Um, but once you, it's really, really simple once you start, uh, doing it a lot. Um, you just kinda get the hang of it. Um, and then also, also a really big thing, um, you want to have everything be tight. So after every time you, uh, make up the loop, uh, you want to have, you want to pull it tight. So, that's the cobra weave. Um, and the difference between, uh, just the one color and the duotone, or two colors, um, is that with the pattern, you kind of have this outer, um, rim right here, this outer, uh, I don't know what the word I'm looking for, uh, outer edge. You have these two outer edges right here, and that would be one color, and then the middle would be the other color, and I'll probably do a video on that. Um, but this is just a quick video on how to, uh, do the Cobra Weave for Paracord Bracelets. Um, I'm not gonna go through the whole thing, uh, just to save some time. But, once you get all the way to the bottom, just get up close to where you made that knot. And then you snip the ends with probably about that much access. Um, and then you burn it with a lighter or what I use as you saw in my um my paracord box video um I just use a tea light candle burn the edges and then you can press the burned edges down but careful not to burn yourself with these things as you can see there uh second degree burn um and blisters and everything <laughs> so it's not pretty so just wait uh, probably I would say 30 seconds after and then just quick like dab down the edges or what I use is the side of a tea light candle so I don't have to touch it and you can do that immediate at, immediately after if you're using another object um so yeah just a video showing you how to make paracord bracelet with the cobra weave so thanks for watching I hope you guys enjoy